16 question. A rectangular prism has a volume of 720 cubic meter and a height of 10 meters. Find its base area. So A, 282 square meter, B, 48 square meter, C, 482 square meter, and D, 72 square meter. So the given R volume is equal to 720 cubic meter and the height of 10 meters. So the formula for the volume is V is equal to base times height or V is equal to length times width times height. So in this case, the given values are volume and height and we want to know the measure of base. So we will use this one volume is equal to base times height and then substitute the given to the formula so we have the volume of 720 cubic meter is equal to b that is the unknown times 10 meters so we have 720 cubic meter is equal to b times 10 meter so we need to divide both sides by 10 meters so you need to cancel this one and then we have 720 cubic meter over 10 meter that is equal to 72 square meters. So the answer is letter D. So question number 17. What is the volume of a right circular cylinder with a base diameter of 6 meters and a height of 10 meters? A, 282 cubic centimeter. Sorry, that is meter. And letter B, 282.6 cubic meter. C, 482.6 cubic meter. And D, 72 cubic meter. Okay, so the given R, or the formula is, volume is equal to pi R squared times height. And the given is diameter. So in the formula, we need to use the radius. So we, the first thing that we need to do is to solve for the radius. To find the radius, we have diameter or D divided by 2. So the diameter is 6 and then divided by 2, we have 3 meters. So the given radius is 3 meters and a height of 10 meters. So... Substitute na natin yung ating given. We have volume is equal to pi 3 square and 10. So pi times 3 square, 3 square times 10. So we have pi times 9 times 10. 9 times 10 is 90. So we have 90 pi or if you want to multiply the pi to 90, use 3.14. We have 282.6 cubic meter. So the answer is letter B. Next, question number 18. Find the area of triangle where B is equal to 18 cm and height of 8 cm. So A, 13 square centimeter, B, 48 square centimeter, C, 72 square centimeter, and D, 20 square centimeter. So the given R, 18 cm for base and 8 cm for height. And the formula is area is equal to 1 half times base times height. So substitute, we have 1 half times our base is 18 and our height is 8. So 18 times 8 is 144 times 1 half, that is 72 square centimeter. So the answer is C. For the 19th question, find the surface area of the figure below. A. 100.48 square centimeter. B. 56.52 square centimeter. C. 43.96 square centimeter. And D. 96 square centimeter. So this is the solution. So the formula for the surface area of a cylinder is 2 pi times r times h plus r. Where r is the radius and h is the height. So, R is equal to 2 meters and H or height is equal to 6 meters. 
So, substitute the given to the formula. We have surface area is equal to 2 pi times 2 times 6 plus 2. So, 6 plus 2 is equal to 8 times 2 and then times 2. That is 32 pi square centimeter. Or, multiply 32 to pi. That is 100.48 square centimeter. So, the answer is letter A. Question number 20. The top floor of the building is rect rectangular whose perimeter is 320 feet. The width is 30 feet less than the length. What is the width of the rectangle? A. 65 feet B. 95 feet C. 130 feet D. 190 feet So the perimeter is 320 and for the width, we have length minus 30. So, that are the given. So, for the formula for perimeter, we have 2 times length plus 2 times width. So, substitute the given. We have the perimeter 320 equals 2 times length plus 2 times width. And the value for width is L minus 30. So, substitute or distribute 2. To, uh, to length times 30. So we have 2 times L, we have 2L, and then 2 times negative 30, that is negative 60. So distribute negative 60 to the other side. We have 320 plus 60 is equal to 2L plus 2L. And then we have 4L is equal to 380. So to find the length, we need to divide both sides by 4. So we have 380 divided by 4, that is 95. To find the value of width or to find for the measure of width, we need to substitute 95 for the length in this equation. W is equal to length minus 30. So substitute 95 to length, we have width is equal to 95 minus 30 so that is equal to 65 so the measure of width is equal to 65 the answer is letter a